And uh, without further ado, let's begin with the roast of our dear friend, Gigi. All right, let's get this started. Gigi, Gigi, Gigi. Look at how fat you've gotten, my God. I took her for a W-A-L-K yesterday and she pooped out Mama Cass. <laughs> hey, Gigi. I think I ate your cousin last night at Kung Pao Kitchen. <laughs> Look at Gigi's eyes. It looks like someone poured Mentos and Diet Coke down her throat and forgot to burp her. <laughs> Gigi, I love you. I wish you the best of luck. So little, Gigi. Gigi, I hate to say it, but you're so ugly. You ought to shave your ass and walk backwards. <laughs> You're so skinny, you could be a stunt double on The Simple Life. <laughs> you look at a cross between a retarded cripple and a Twinkie. <laughs> Gigi, you little bitch. <laughs> Uh, you know, they say the dog is man's best friend, but, uh, I don't believe that. I mean, how many of your friends have you ever neutered? <laughs> you know, um, Gigi's a great dog, half Chihuahua, half Oscar Mayer. A decent snack if you can get the damn thing to stand still. <laughs> Thanks, Gigi. We love you, baby. Uh, Gigi's so dumb she thinks Fetch is a Chevy Chase movie. <laughs> oh man, Gigi's breath is so bad, I don't know whether to give her a breath mint or toilet paper. <laughs> oh. But, alright, that's I, I can't keep Gigi with you. I, I love you, Gigi. As is with tradition with all roasts, our guest of honor will now get her revenge. Please welcome everybody, Gigi. Hey, Mike. First of all, it's Gigi, not Gigi. And you wouldn't even be here if we didn't have to meet an ethnic diversity quota. Yeah, I think you're just jealous I have a full head of hair and you don't. Hey, Dan, for future reference, when people don't laugh at your jokes, it means you weren't funny. And Brian, I hope you enjoyed eating my cousin last night. Just remember, you are what you eat. Okay, folks, that's all I got. Have a good night. <laughs> 